Yo guys, what's poppin'? It's time for shopping. Back at it with another Black Ops Cold War franchise store video. This one's gonna be for April 15th. We got three brand new bundles here today, guys. One of them is a free bundle and the other two are feature bundles. So a really nice week when it comes to content. We had that Corpse Collector, then we had Hellscream, and now we have some more feature content. I am all for getting a ton of awesome new stuff. So make sure you guys are slapping a like on today's video, man. Make sure you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any shop content whatsoever across all the games. Let's just hop right in. We're going to start with the free bundle because obviously that one's going to be the shortest one and we'll just get it out of the way. We actually have a blueprint in here. So I'm hoping all of you guys will get this one here today. Make sure you're logging on and checking. You know, sometimes these bundles don't last that long. Highly recommend just hop on, grab yourself this free bundle. But we have Northern Aggression. I'm going to do a full gameplay on it. You know how we do. If you guys watch the uh, gunfight reward blueprint gameplay I had, it's actually, it has a good laugh in it. I mean, I was kind of getting pissed off and it was pretty funny. And, um, you know, I did a full review on it if you guys are interested. But so we got the muzzle break, the hangman RF, which I'm going to assume is just going to be range finder on that. And then we have speed grip. So not a lot of attachments. Obviously, it's free. So I'm not going to knock it regardless. Cosmetically, I actually really like this one, man. You got like a tan and green going on. And then you have the red accents and the red magazine, which the magazine looks amazing. You guys know anything metallic, anything metal that has um, a nice chrome effect to it. I like so. It looks really, really good, and I'm all for it, man. Um, I think that says CSCO. You guys know the reference behind that. Let me know. But uh, I like it, man. For a free bundle, I'll take that all day long. I don't know if I have any tight blueprints at all, actually. So I'm rocking with that. I might have one or two, but I like this one a lot. And being free, can't go wrong with that. We also got the double weapon XP, 15 minutes for anybody who might want that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and claim that. Purchase complete. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Treyarch, we appreciate the uh, the freebie every once in a while. We do, we do. So, we have Stitch Sentinel, and we have Rookie Mistake. I think we're going to start with Rookie Mistake, since it's pretty short. We got Laughing Stock here for the Shadow Hunter. I believe that's what it's called. Um, okay. Looks like we have some sort of, like, dart action going on here. You got a little, little target and kaboom on the cheek pad. You got some darts there actually stuck in the cheek pad. Then you have some bows under your line or under your string. And then you have some uh, connected to the stock. You have some bullets. Not bad. Ooh, that metal like a, like tint or effect actually looks really nice. It, like pearlescent. It looks really nice. I like it, man. It's interesting. I think there was another, the one they first came out with the crossbow. It was like the, the one with the bones or whatever. That one was so much cooler. I really do like that one. Let's check out this Port Nova skin, though. Port Nova has some really cool skins in the game. This one's called Moving Target. I like the bullet bracelet. The sling backpack's pretty cool. Got some more bullets there. It's all right. I don't love it. I actually... Is that... Got a pack of cigarettes taped to the helmet. That's pretty cool. There's some pretty cool details with this one. Definitely not my favorite. Like, like I said, Port Nova has some really solid skins. So I probably wouldn't run this one over any other ones, but um, it's still cool in its own way. I really like that eight ball grenade there as well on the uh, jean jacket. That's pretty cool. Then we have uh, Missiles Ahoy. Then Bowbreaker. All right, not bad. Not bad at all. We got Stitch Sentinel coming up. 2,400 cob points. Pretty standard for one of the main operator bundles. So let's check it out. Forest Sentinel. I'm going to be honest, man, I think this is one of the worst Stitch skins, unless you would, you know, be going for this camouflage for whatever reason. Um, you know, maybe you're, you're shooting for, like, that swamp theme or, you know, just kind of this camouflage pattern we got going on here. Uh, might be a little bit better in some of the open areas on Warzone or something or any of the open, more open maps, maybe fire team maps or something on Cold War. But I think the original Stitch skin is still always going to be the best, the one with the dog tag necklace. It's just super, super sick. Uh, this one's still cool, though. Just not for me. Overrun. This is going to be for the Mac 10 You got the Muzzle Break 9, 5-milliwatt laser, 53-round fast mag, drop shot wrap, wire stock. Uh, pretty shitty attachments, but looks really interesting. Um, cosmetically, not for me in any way at all, but I'm going to be honest. There's a lot of people who probably really dig this. The wood pistol grip looks amazing, uh, and the camouflage does look cool in its own way. It's really unique, and uh, I do like it. It's just it's not for me. So a lot of people might really like that one. It's definitely cool. So we have Cottontail coming up here for the Pellington. Now, this looks really, really sick so far. Um, let's see what we got. 
See if it's better than the Hell Scream. Not better than Hell Scream, but I will say I really like this. This is really nice. You know, it's it's dark. It looks really good. It's simple and plain, but at the same time, you got a little extra. You got like different. I don't know if it's paracord or just regular string. What it is, but the wrap looks really nice. It looks decent. I personally really like it. I actually really like simple designs when it comes to sniper rifles in, um, you know, in question. But this one looks good. I like this one. Stabilizer, extended barrel, seven round mag, serpent wrap, tattoo stop. Your best thing there is your serpent wrap. Everything else is pretty much level 10 or lower. Honestly, I'm still giving this one the pass. I really like how it looks cosmetically, personally. Rearrange something. Oh, yeah. Rearrange thoughts. Yep. Watch one more time. So, so does that first bullet clip his shoulder or does it clip the side of his head? Nah, that's a headshot. Double headshot. Double banger. All right. Good stuff. Oni reticle. That's actually really, really cool. That's sick. It's a cool looking reticle. Um, Haunted Vision. I want to know what that skin is. I want that operator, that skin. You got like the glow in the dark, like uh, skeleton pattern on his glove. I want that. That's what I want. We have Muster the Spirit. Pretty wacky looking. Carbononi. Come on. There it is. There's some gold teeth going on. All right. And then you have Faceless Agent. And that is going to wrap it up for the bundles here today, guys. Let me know what you guys are picking up. Are you picking up the new Stitch bundle? Are you picking up a rookie mistake? Let me know in the comments below. Now, a really decent week of content, I will say. Uh, Corpse Collector was super, super sick. You know, this is a must-buy, in my opinion. Uh, the Stitch Sentinel isn't bad, not for me, but you guys might really like it. Rookie Mistake's pretty cool in its own way. Hellscream was, you know, just phenomenal, in my opinion. A really nice one as well. If you use the Pellington, definitely recommend you pick this one up. I was also thinking, I wanted to ask you guys, you know, if you made it this far in the video, I appreciate you so much. I wanted to ask you guys, you think I should change the titles of these videos? Just do like Cold War and the usual stuff, um, Shop of the Week, the new feature bundle, have the date in there. And then um, if we should just like put some of the bundles at the end of the title, like for this week or for this video, it'd be Stitch Sentinel and Rookie Mistake free bundle, you know, just at the end of the title. And we can knock out some of that other stuff. I think it says like operators and blueprints or something like that. I don't know. I was thinking about it, thinking about more ways to bring in some more people to check out some of these new bundles. Um, we don't have to change it at all. You know, it's been like this since the beginning of Modern Warfare, and I don't want to change something you guys are used to. I don't want to fuck up my algorithm at all. So we'll see what happens, but I do appreciate all the support. Make sure you guys leave it a like, subscribe, if you're new sponsors, and equipment description below. That is all I got, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'm out.